Uh, 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 Do I uh, have to replace my divot? <laughs> no. On our way out towards the salt flats. Pretty much a fantastic morning. Weather's nice. Got some good clouds over the mountains are really pretty with the sn fresh snow on them. And we are out for one of our good days. We love to just go out and explore. Side view, oh, Aaron. Because <laughs> you don't usually get that. Not very much, anyway. Yep. I told Aaron that he has to tell this story, and he wasn't excited about it, but I'm going to do it anyway. Ever since Annalyn was little, she was fascinated with big trucks, like most kids are, but especially garbage trucks. And she would point them out, garbage truck, garbage truck. And we live in a big city area, and so we see them a lot. Well, it became this who could find them first and who could get it out fastest, who could say garbage truck. I've gotten pretty darn good at saying garbage truck really quickly. Um, but Annalyn and Aaron still are better at finding them than I am because I get distracted. And especially if I'm talking, they have the advantage. But Annalyn loved when she was old enough and tall enough to move to the front seats so she can um, have a better view and better competition, therefore, for garbage trucks. So, um, I've said that, you know, till my dying day, I may not remember my name when I have Alzheimer's, or, but I'll say garbage truck when I see them. For the moment, we're at the Great Salt Lake. We're hanging out at Aladdin's Castle. That's actually the Salt Air. They do, uh, it's an event venue. And it's loosely based on the original salt tailor, which was huge, and I believe... I think it was down that direction, but I'm not positive. Or it might have been, might have been to the east, I don't remember. But I'm doing a few time lapses while I'm out here and goofing around a bit. Now look at this, we found... Or something, we don't know. All right. All right. So I've got my snowball. I've got my, let's see, what is this one? I don't know anything about golf. It's a driver, that's all I know. A one, one wood, I don't know. I was gonna do it with that. But... All right, I have no idea what I'm doing. Well, since I've been golfing, like since I was 14, the last time I went golfing, I got my, I got my golfing merit badge. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> divot. Uh, uh, Do I have to replace my divot? <laughs> no. That went about mm, a foot. A foot? Oh, I don't think it was much more than a foot, Aaron. Woo! Oh, and it's out of the park. Except you don't say that for golf. That was about, I would guess, six feet in all directions. <laughs> it's pretty powdery snow. I'm surprised you got some to stick together into a ball. No, actually, it's pretty wet. Oh, is it? It is. These are much easier to hit than a smaller golf ball. Well, and I imagine it is wet or snow out here because of the lake. Be more human. Oh, it didn't even go anywhere. 
No. That was inches. I got underneath it. <laughs> that was a good solid hit. I could hear the flock. All right. Yeah, so if any of you were out golfing by the Saltaire, we got your clubs. Well, we don't have them. We'll just leave them here. We found your club. We found your clubs. <laughs> yep. That was kind of fun. <laughs> <laughs> Down that way is the Salt Lake Marina, or at least the South Shore Salt Lake Marina. Past that is Black Rock. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to make it as far as Black Rock. Depends on the roads because it's a it's a uh, dirt road headed down that way. Pretty sure the, the beast back there can make it, but we're going to try that next. But I did get that. I think is the. Uh, is the power plant for the copper mine. So we're going to head down this way in a minute. The battery on my camera died, so that's it for that time lapse. up to go. I had that camera right there out at the end of at the end of that. I've got my little camera over there. I've got my cell phone over there. Three time lapses going. I hope some of them at least turn out. But I'm learning a lot from all my experimenting so that's good. If I'd realized how nice it was going to be out here, I would have brought my quadcopter because I'd like to get some aerials of this rock here. But I was expecting it to be windy out here. It almost always is. But it's actually really nice.
Well, my day is pretty much over, and we had a really good day today. We actually got out, and got out of the valley mostly, did some uh, good photography, and had a good time today. Hit Fizz again, and uh, yeah, it's been a good day. Um, tomorrow, I don't know what we're going to be doing. I expect we'll be hitting Fizz once more. Um, and also, we are planning a trip another trip to Oregon for around spring bait time or so. So, anyway, I don't know what's going to happen, but I'll see you tomorrow. Mm -hmm.